Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Bradley Ralph Top 3 here on, on the NEW YouTube channel. I'm your host, the Elder Tiger, Bradley Ralph. And so instead of a Top 3, we're going to do a Top 5. Because I think that'll be a lot better. So, and plus 2, there was a lot of great moments in there. So this is still my Top 3 show, but at the same time, it's a Top... This is going to be my Top 5. And we're going to be doing it for NEW Rivals. At number 5 is going to be James Patrick with... At number one was the, the first the first time ever, the eight years in the making. What the hell? All right, I just got out of a board meeting, you know, hence the tie instead of the usual attire. And I'm handed what we just witnessed in draft form, which of course already, already went out the door, so I can't really make changes, but I, I, I'm lost for words at the moment. Um, first off, you do know what a gimmick is, son, right? We don't think you're an actual tiger. It was an in-ring joke, actually. That's kind of why the ref's character is the way it is now, but that's besides the point. This is a top three, I believe, moments, which is somehow spread onto like top five but that's the other thing moments spots <sighs> not matches we wanted to know top matches we just watched the show because that's every match especially at rivals especially at rivals but number five james fucking patrick are you kidding me i wouldn't even put him in my top six we're top 60, and we don't even have that many people. We only like the fucker because uh, we had to. He was a face. Back ring politics, he was a dick. <sighs> and just, just the factual thing, like... <sighs> Navon versus Gemini was eight years in the making? I think you might be a little off on that. Just, just a little. Let's put it this way. When I interrupted the last episode, it wasn't so much to you know, give some critiques as it was to give a warning that if the show kept seeming like a pile of crap made by a mark instead of a member of the family, it might just get cancelled. So, uh... Well, I haven't quite said those magic words, I guess that's more up to the board. People might want to start tuning in to Tyson Spade's top moments. Seems to be quite superior in quality, the little preview I saw. This shit. <laughs> 